All of the credit for this video tutorial goes to that beast, Ron Gatlin. I want to show you something that he showed me, which is how to incorporate a uh, grading rubric for upload assignments. First you'll click on add an activity or a resource, click on assignment. This is where your students will upload files, images, and so forth. We'll name it something simple. Uh, don't forget to describe your assignment for the students. And since the purpose of this video is to show you the rubric, uh, we're not going to go through all of the various and sundry options you have. We'll scroll down to grade. We're going to keep the top grade at 100. We will choose rubric, save and display. Now you're going to define the uh, parameters of your rubric, so you'll click on this. We'll name our rubric and give it some description. At this point, your rubric, or at least the rubric that you're going to create, is down here. The first category that you're going to grade on your students, you can simply click in this area, a field will pop open. And it comes standard with 0, 1, 2 uh, points. If you want to add more points, maybe 0 to 5, just simply keep clicking add a level. If you want to add a another set of standards, so citations and, oh, I don't know. We'll add another uh, criteria. And of course, as the red uh, fields up here are showing us, we need to label each one of these. You must label these fields with something or you can't uh, save and continue with the rubric. Uh, another thing you may want to note is the boxes are rather small, but if you want to click and drag in the bottom right hand corner, it will allow you to uh, see a little bit more of the text that you're typing in. So we're going to put in two criteria for our rubric. These, box are, these boxes are checked uh, because they're all good ideas, but I'll let you uh, read through these to figure out if you want to display these, uh, these options or not. So we're going to go ahead and save rubric and make it ready. And here is your rubric. So you can pull up the student's assignments, read it, and simply click through the rubric this student has uh, five out of six points. In this field below, you can explain why you chose to give them five out of six points. And then click Save Changes. Since they received five out of six points, that is an 83 out of a 100. Grading essays made easy via rubrics in NetSchool. Thank you, Ron Gatlin. You're a beast. If you have any questions, you can email me at ccooper at nisdtx.org or follow me on Twitter at Thrasymachus, that is T-H-R-A-S-Y-M-A-C-H-U-S. Thanks for watching.